What? 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 It's a living. Oh, the human arrives! Are you ready to hang out with Undone? I have a plan to make you two great friends! Yeah. Okay! Stand behind me! Psst. Make sure to give her this. She loves these. Hi, Virus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? You bet I am! And I brought a friend! Hi, I don't think we've... Why don't you two come in? Here, Undyne! My friend brought a gift for you! On their own! Uh, thanks. Uh, put it with the others. Are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie! I just remembered! I have to go to the bathroom! You do have fun! I fucking love you, Papyrus! Why are you here? Rub your victory in my face? Humiliate me even further? Is that it? No. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think that I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right? Yes. Really? How delightful! I accept! Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship! Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Dang! What a shame! I thought Undyne could be friends with you! But I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus! Wait a second! Darn it. Thinks I can't be friends with you? <laughs> what a joke. I can make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be besties. I'll make you like me so much, you won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's the perfect revenge. Why don't you have a seat? Okay. Down and progress? Yes. Comfortable? Well, I'll get you something to drink. All set. What would you like? Hey! Don't get up! You're the guest! Sit down and enjoy yourself! Um, why not just point to what you want? You can use the sphere. Blatantly correct choice. E, huh? Come right up. Take a moment for the water to boil. You're fucking late! By the time you tell me to do a thing, you're late. Okay. Well done. J guys, just. There we are. Careful, it's hot. It's not that hot, just drink it already. Take a sip of the tea. Burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. Pretty good tea. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Hey. No, it's kind of strange you chose that tea. Bone flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, kind of remind me of him. You're both total weedies! Sort of. No, I wasn't.
was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once to prove I was the strongest, tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. Couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time, he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad, but he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Like, uh, Papyrus. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just, well, I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's, he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. You could never send him into battle. You'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. That's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know? Though so, um, maybe he can do something else with his life. Oh, sorry, I was take talking for so long. Well, alright guys, let me take a pause here. Let me take a pause here. So... I ran a poll, and Undertale was the first game to win. I wasn't surprised, and in all honesty, I wanted to beat Undertale because I kept seeing pictures posted on Google+. I've already been spoiled to shit. Already. There are a couple things that people in the chat have told me that I've appreciated. Mostly the whole entire thing with the keys from RD with Sans at the end that I would have never fucking figured out. I do not use Streambot. Uh... Neo Mega Koopa is a friend, Orb Pixel I've seen before, Wild Idiot is talking right now, uh, Game Dude just won AFK, I think, RD is a mod and a friend, Rage Master is a friend, Afro is a friend. I don't use a stream bot. Well, uh, oh, you mean like, I, sorry, I thought you meant viewer bot. Yeah, I use a stream bot, I use Triscuit bot, he's a custom hosted guy on a little box right there. Anyway, back to what I was saying. I want to get through the game so that I can actually enjoy all the fan art and spoilers and shit without feeling spoiled even though I've already been to a degree but at the same time I don't like being backseated generally because I like to explore games myself and if I miss something oh fucking well because what happens is when you guys tell me to do something and I miss it half a second later because of the stream delay it makes me feel bad because I missed something whereas if I was completely like ignorant of that I wouldn't have fucking missed something because I wouldn't have fucking known I don't plan to do a second playthrough of this game or anything, necessarily. I don't know, maybe a while down the line, but as of right now, I just want to beat it. At least, Pacifist Run. So, that's what I'm working on now, okay? I know you guys really want to help, and I do appreciate it, and I understand the desire to want to tell people how to play games, because I fucking do it. I know, I know. Just please... Let me enjoy Undertale my way, okay? Happy? Smiles? Okay, good. Let's continue. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Wait a second. Pyrus, it's a cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him. right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking, which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. <laughs> Afraid we're going to be best friends. Ah, Papyrus. You're a lucky guy. Let's start with the sauce. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. What do you pound? Pet the vegetables in an affectionate manner. Oh my god! Stop petting the enemy! I'll show you how it's done. Ah! <laughs> uh, we'll just scrape this into a bowl later. 
But for now, we add the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy store brand. They're the cheapest. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just put them in the pot. Oh, you put them in. Careful. You place the noodles in one at a time. They clink against the empty bottom. Nice. All right. Now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Ugh, let me do it. That's the stuff. All right, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let's stop top symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Uh, let me do it. See, this is how you... Ah, man, no wonder papyrus sucks at cooking. What's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship races? Oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? Can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me. But if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret. I've been defeated. My ass is in shambles. I even feel to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you've got. Yeah! Show me what you've got. Do your worst. What's the matter, scared? What the hell is wrong? Come on already! I'm getting hot in here! Pretend to swing it undying with all your might. What? That's the best you can manage? I'm gonna attack you at full force. You just can't muster any intent to hurt me, huh? <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid century stick, but the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you aren't just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight. But knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here. And I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> well, let's get the hell out of this flaming house. <laughs> That's probably a good idea. Well, that was fun, huh? Wanted to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out with Papyrus. So if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot, I'll be able to talk to you. Oh, see you later, punk. Oh, wait! This is sudden, but... Can you... Hey, wait. Your inventory's full. Uh, well... I'll be at Papyrus's. Come see me when you have less stuff. Okay, well, I guess I have to, um... Okay, well, CT is going in the inventory. Oh, that's great. Nope, I have to go, uh... a oh, wrong way. Right, I have to go to the right. Correct, I have to go to the right. Get back to the waterfall, and I'm heading back to Snowden, and then we'll head to the core. 
Uh, the next game in the backlog is finishing my current playthrough of Valkyria Chronicles. Yeah, I bought a bunch of crab apples with money that I got from, uh, doing, uh, dupes on the fucking, uh, Temi, uh, flakes. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, if I decide to do, like, a, I uh, bring an, um, exorcist run, whatever it's called. Oh, it'll probably be on my own time. It'll be off cast, if anything. But since that's gonna be longer, I doubt I'll do it. I have a favor to ask. Uh, I, I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Alphys. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Um, well, kind of personal, but we're friends, so I'll t tell you. Hotland slugs! I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. Got the Undyne's letter. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. Yeah, that friggin' thing. I did that for a little while, and I managed to get l literally everything you saw in my inventory. All of the apples and the, um... Eat a mushroom every day. Why? And they know I'm listening. Well, if I knew where to buy mushrooms, I'd buy some mushrooms. Assuming I had money. Back to the lab. The office! The door has no mail slot. Slide under the door? No. The letter waiting for a little longer. Uh, is there any way to get around here? Man who speaks in hens. This is still sort of a demonic kind of place, don't you think? Oh yeah, it's a friggin' show. Oh, I wanted the cheese. Damn it, poor mice. Oh, I can't go backwards. Oh, that's great. Okay, I guess I have to slide it under the door then. Wonder. All right, I'm I'm legitimately asking. Do I just slide it under the door? Cause I gather there's no other good way to get under there, get in there again. No option to ring the doorbell even. How rude. Yeah, gathered as such. That's fine. No other way to get in there. Uh, oh, no. Is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Can't I just slide it back out? Uh, no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it's kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I have no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no. That's adorable! I had no idea you wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven, much less I'm- This? So passionately, too. You know what? Okay, I'll do it. The least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a date. Dating, start. Mark. Uh, sorry. Still getting dressed. Where do I look? Friend helped me pick out this dress. He's got a great sense of, um... Anyway, let's do this thing. Hey, wait. Actually, can we still can't start the date yet. Dating, stop? Um, I've gotta give you time to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date, right? Anyway, don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. First, I've got a metal armor polish. Uh, maybe you can't use that, but I also brought some waterproof cream for your skills. Your, uh, skills. Uh, well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I, um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Dating, start! 
Yeah, let's have a date. She looked cross-eyed for a second. Uh, do you like anime? Hell yeah! Hey, me too! Hey, let's go somewhere. Where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. Yes, I am a weeb. Thank you. Here we are. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. Find all sorts of great stuff here. Hey, he's really, uh... Oh no. That's her over there. Can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because I will Oh no, here she comes. Hey, there you are. I uh, realize if you deliver that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Ah! Have you seen her at least? Have you at least seen her? Hmm. Yeah. Yes? She's somewhere around here. Thanks, I'll keep looking. Oh my god. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh, I really like her. I mean, like... I mean more than I like other people. Sorry, I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on, a, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. Oh, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry, I messed up again. And I'm a person I really want to go on a date with, but I mean, she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't, uh, cool, but, but I, she's so confident and strong and funny, and I'm just a nobody. Broad. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. She gets close to me, she'll, she'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Tell her the truth. The truth? If I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? We'll live a lie where most people are happy, where truth where neither of us are. I'd say be yourself. If I don't really like who myself is, I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> Oh, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared of what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up? How can I practice? Boom! <clears throat> Let's roleplay it. R roleplay? That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be Undyne? I'll be Undyne. Oh, right. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? I'm fine. Ah, huh. glad to hear it. Uh, so I'd like to, um, talk to you about something. Why is it, office? Um, you see, I, I, I haven't been exactly truthful with you. You see, I, I, oh, forget it. Undyne! I, I want to tell you how I feel. So brave and so strong and nice. You're always listening to me when I need to talk about nerdy stuff. You always do your best to make me feel special. Like telling me that you'll beat up anything that get, anyone that gets in my way. I'm done! You can't take this any longer! I'm madly in love with you! Oh me, I died! Oh me! What did you just say? Uh... Undyne! I was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. It's the occasion. Wait a second. You two, on a date? Uh, yes! I mean, uh, no! I mean, we were, but... I mean, actually, we were only romantically role-playing as you. What? I mean... I mean... Undyne, I... I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well... Everything. <clears throat> I told you that seaweed was like scientifically important. Really, I just had to just use it to make ice cream. Those human history books I keep reading, those are just dark comic books. And the history movies, those, those are just uh, anime. They aren't real. And the time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I, I was just eating frozen yogurt in my office. I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. I wasn't some nerdy loser. Office. And then I I really think you're neat, okay? Office.
office! I think you're neat, too, I guess. But you've got to realize, most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kids' cartoons or reading history books. To me, all of that stuff is just nerdy crap! What I like about you is that you're passionate! You're analytical! It doesn't matter what it is. You care about it! 100% at maximum power! So, you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Alphys, I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the training you need to do that. I'm dying. You... You gonna train me? What? Me? Nah. I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shake. Get those bones shaking! It's time to jog a hundred laps! You think about how great we are! Ready? I'm about to start the timer. Uh, Undyne. Do my best. Oh my god! She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics... Those are still real, right? Anime's real, right? Of course the anime is real. <laughs> I knew it! Enchanting swords, magical princesses, here I come! Uh, thanks for taking care of Alphys. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, I gotta go catch up with them. Later! Of course anime is real. What'd you expect? Non-real anime? Partaking in the worthless garbage fills you with determination. Hi! <laughs> but this is my good friend who trusts me. This is Papyrus, your also mutual friend. Office and I finished our training early. Very early. So I sent her home. Very home. Uh, now, I feel strongly in for no apparent reason. You should also go there. To her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye! What? Okay then. Yep. Not surprised, honestly. La la la, I care for a ride. Hotland. <clears throat> Off to Hotland we go. It's always a cat every other time. Tra la la, what's inside an acorn? It's really just a mystery. Again, some time. Tra la la. <laughs>